morning everybody and welcome along to another video it was uh, it's been touch and go as to whether we're going to be out today it's Sunday the 3rd of, uh, of March we're going to go out yesterday because it would look fine then the rain came and then we looked at the day and uh, looks like we're going to do it today so I'm off to meet up with uh, Kev and then we're going to meet up with Paul little Paul and then we're going to meet up with uh, uh, we're going to meet up with Paul's mate who's coming out with us. I've met him before, so he's a new, uh, a new one. And the bar red mirrors on now. I hope you like them. They're miles better than the ones I had the originals. Worlds apart, these are these are great. I like these. Um, so I've got the bar red mirrors. I've got the camera centralised now. So uh, hopefully. It's, uh, everything's going to be uh, symmetrical. So it's a bit of an experimentation day today and I'm also using a, a rear facing camera. And uh, yeah, so it's all part of the, uh, the new setup for 2024. And uh, yeah, I'm looking over my glasses at the moment because I can't see where I'm steaming up. So it's quite chilly. got my easy gloves on but I haven't got them switched on. So, uh, yeah, I don't know where we're going. It's pretty unprompted, as I say, impromptu, pretty much unplanned ride out. Uh, I'm on Stan the Scrum. Um, yeah, so we'll, uh, we'll have a chat as we, uh, as we go through the day. And uh, you should, hopefully, and hear a new voice on the comms today, uh, because Kevin has got a cardo. So, uh, a focus to plan, we're going to hear Kevin. Now we just need to get him linked up when we meet up. And, uh, yeah, all good to go. Oh, so we've got a new, new guy with us I haven't met. I think his name's Dave. So we've got loads of Daves, loads of Pauls, uh, just to add a bit more confusion. Oh, I'm so pleased with these mirrors. They're absolutely brilliant, these are. Well, uh, thank you to that gentleman at Nuisance Phone Caller on the Service Day video, who, uh, who was very critical of the mirrors, to be honest. Um, but I think he was right. Well, so we'll see what he thinks of these when he sees them. Very strange gentleman, I'm not sure where he was from. I've got a feeling it was the same man. Um, impersonating people. So, uh, we shall see. See if we get any more unsolicited calls from him. Oh, I've been itching for a ride out, you know. But we have it's just the weather this year so far, through January and February. Jeez, it's been horrendous. And uh, end of the month, Stan will be off to Wales. For the summer. Oh, I, I actually believe it's spring now. I'm never sure when the spring and autumn equinox are, the, the dates of the spring and autumn equinox. I know where the uh, winter and summer solstice are. But uh, not the. Uh, I should know that really, shouldn't I? I don't know why I don't know. So we'll see if I've beaten Kev here. We said 9.15, so. He may be a bit early. Oh, I think a bit slippy there, so I need to wash it this morning. There is some ice. I had to clean Sam's car off before I could take it off the drive, so I had to defrost her car. So I think there's a bit of uh, ice on the road this morning. Just need to be careful. You there, Kev? Yeah. Oh, okay, how you doing? Is that good? You, when nobody's speaking, he goes, that quiet, you think? Is it working? Yeah. Well, that's great, boy. Here's where I fell to slip. Uh, on that island I there. come down my road, Dave, and uh, the, sun hadn't, the sun hadn't hit it. Yeah. And um, bloody hell, I felt the back end go. Yeah. 
I think give it another another hour, Dave, and the temperature should have rise by then. So. Yeah, we'd be good by then, won't we? Yeah, should be all right then. We're in this one, Dave. Right, on, mate. Blimey, it's a bit bright. Did you really care? Nope. When we stop, we'll sort it out. I paired with him up at the uh, up at Sainsbury's. God believe it, I can't understand that. I hate he went tech down work, he does me flipping head in. It's just something that's happened, mate. Yeah. We're going right to that island, mate. Ah. Are you straight on, all right? Bye. Right. Okay, I'm here. Hey. Yeah. You hear me, Dave? Hello. Can you hear me? Yeah. <laughs> what did you do? Please. I ain't done nothing. <laughs> I just, I just heard you talking, and I thought oh, I'll give it another go. Oh, that's good, we sorted then. Brilliant. I was getting lonely because it was Paul A talking to me this morning. <laughs> oh, steady, steady lads, that's a bit tricky there. Yeah. Watch it there. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I thought he fell out with me. You know, talking to me. I'm, con I'm, I'm concentrating because of my tyres. I oh, know, you've got to be really careful on them tyres. Yeah. How much, how, how many, have you been out on them since you had them on? Nah, mate. Oh, blimey, take it really careful then. What's time, Dave? Yeah, take it really careful. Three nice conditions as well, bloody hell. Oh, we've got to introduce <laughs> Kev to the viewers now, because they have uh, heard yeah, it properly yeah. before, have they? Kev! Ah! He's gone off again! What? How is he? You gotta say hello to the viewers. Oh. <laughs> we got a thousand of them now. Thousand. Uh, Fantastic, Dave. Thousand. Fantastic. So, uh, yeah. And they, they know us all by name now. And that's the thing. Yeah. They actually talk about us. Right, Jeff can do us. <laughs> hey. Jeff can do us. No bad. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, Ick. Cheers. Uh, we got too many Pauls and now we got too many Daves. Yeah. Oh, God, no. Too many Daves. Too many Daves. Not four Pauls, are we? Four? Is it four? Aye. It's four Pauls. Or three. Three Pauls. Three Pauls. Three Pauls. Two Daves now. Two days, one Kev. We used to have two Kevs, but now we've only got one. Yeah. One Joe. One uh, Brian. One Ellen. I've just got to get me CCM MOT'd now. Sorry, Dave. I've just got to get me CCM MOT'd now. It's MOT. Is it off the road? Well, it's in a bag at the moment. <laughs> it's uh, MOT expired last Thursday. Well, I'm in no rush to get it done. When I take it How many you got? How many you got now, bikes? Four. Five. Four. <laughs> <laughs> oh. you, never, you never have enough bikes, Dave. Never have no, enough. No. Never have enough bikes. Not have a sword, Colin. I tell you what, if I won the lottery and I won a decent amount of money, I just buy loads of motorbikes. And uh, I just, that's what I'd have, I'd get a big house, with, well, not necessarily a big house, but a big garage or a big barn or something. Yeah. I'd buy, yeah. I'd buy motorbikes and what I'd do, I'm, I'd invite you to come down 
and just we'd go out for a ride and you just pick the one you want to go out on on, on that ride. Oh, that's, great. Great. that's what that's what Bloody I'd do. Brilliant. And I'd what I'd do as well, if it was enough money like a good win, I'd employ a permanent uh, <laughs> uh bike cleaner. So uh, Gareth, he could that's have his job, he could be on a retainer. And uh, a day a week, oh. all he's got to do is come and yeah. clean bikes. Yeah. If if they ain't dirty, he ain't got to do anything. He could just put his feet up. But yeah. die, but if he, that's what I'd do. He'd love it, man. That's, that'd be my life. That'd be my life, that would. Yeah, I think I'd have a garage bigger than the house, Dave. I'd definitely have a garage bigger than the house. Much bigger than the definitely. house. Definitely. Yeah. Definitely. You'd have a decent man, Kevin, yeah. Oh. You would, uh, you would. Yeah. Yeah, and you got texture, I'd say, free the weekend, boys, come over, and you just pick whatever you want you want, and yeah, we go off and. Oh, oh aye, great. Aye, that'd be nice, wouldn't you? I don't think the, uh, our good ladies would be too impressed with that, but we would find a way. We'd have to... Uh, I don't... I don't think right, they would. Right, send them to spa weekends, that's what we could do. Because yeah, yeah, we're loaded. Just, you know, go off and stick uh, cucumbers on your eyes and stuff like that. While we're, uh, while we're out playing. <laughs> that's, that's what we could do. Sorted. That'll solve that problem for us. Brilliant, yeah. Send them on pampering weekends. Where do you say we're going, Kev? First up, what I'm going to do, Dave, get down to Drywich. Oh. Towards the Chateau in me, and then get the back Low way battery. down to Alcester. Okie dokie. Is that alright? Yeah, that's great, mate. Okay, mate. Great. Okay. Oh, did I tell you about my grandson? He's four years old, my grandson. Ah. Four years old, yeah. and he doesn't know how to say please in Spanish. That's oh. that's poor for four, already. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <Get it now. laughs> that's terrible, dear. Terrible. <laughs> well, I went up the uh, graveyard the other day, <laughs> and there were some blokes walking round with a coffin, and I thought. Well, that's bloody weird. I thought, well, I don't take the notice, like, you know. So when I come back out after, walking around with it, I thought, they've lost the plot, they have. <laughs> oh, dear God. You good? Yeah. What's a butcher's favourite drink? What's a what? A butcher's favourite group. Uh, I don't know. Put the pork chops. I got them for me dinner. Uh, I don't get chop. it. <laughs> not, not the pork chops, Dave, the pork chops. <laughs> It's a, Tony, it's a Tony Blackburn joke. <laughs> it's Kev down there. The four chops. Oh, God. Have you heard the, uh, the Ricky Gervais joke that he's brought up to date? He's brought it up to date for modern times. So, oh, oh, so in the 70s, a uh, doctor joke, yeah? Doctor, yeah. Doctor, it's 1970. Doctor, Doctor, I fall off a pair of curtains. Doctor replies, pull yourself together then. <laughs> no, Doctor, oh. Doctor, I think of a pair of curtains. Doctors reply, you are then. <laughs> <laughs> Ricky, <laughs> Ricky Gervais. <laughs> oh, God. When we get to the top of this hill, lads, it should be on the right hand side. Okay, Kev. Okay, Kev. Okay. Yeah, man.
There we go, boys. Brilliant. The piston, blood. Cotswolds coffee. What is the car meets on here? Oh, blow oh great. Oh dear. Here. Bikes as well. Scooters. Okay, good. Cheers, bud. Busy eight. Hi. She's busy eight. Can you it? Max Power. Nearly a speed trap down here. Sir. Yeah. I think what is that? Yeah, I think it's a bit further up there. I'll tell you today. I've enjoyed today. Thanks, Kev. I have not. That was a nice place to go, that was. It was lovely, wasn't it? it? Made a very pleasant change, that did. Somewhere different, and we kept off the back roads, which was wise by because of the uh, frost. Yeah. It's good. I enjoyed that. Marvellous. Nice bit of sausage, and all. Said the art mistress to the gardener. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Dave's enjoyed it as well, isn't he? I've well, he's enjoyed it, Dave. Excellent. But he's had a good ride out, haven't he, Dave? Yeah, proper ride. He'll, yeah. Have to, he'll have to come out again next time. 
Yeah, you come out there, don't you come out all the time, I'd say. I don't know what we do it in the week. Yeah, because you don't have problems keeping up. No! He will have that look, I don't think he'll take his test. Yeah. See you, mate. See you soon, Kev. So that was a nice ride out with Kev and little Paul and Dave. Dave is uh, Paul's partner's daughter's boyfriend. Yeah, there you go. That's who, uh, that's who Dave is. And he was on his uh, 125, uh, Keyway 125. He kept up with us. Well, mind you, we don't speed anyway. But he kept up with us really well all the way through. And uh, looks like we might have another member of the gang. So that's great. Welcome along, Dave. Look forward to having some more ride outs with you. So as I say, today was a bit of an impromptu ride out. Um, and I've got a home now. Changed. Blimey, now this bike rides. Blimey, so lovely at the moment. Um, yeah. All right, probably give the bike a bit of a, a wash down, swirl down. And then it's dinner time. So it just leaves me to say, just leaves me to say, I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, entertained you a little bit, made you laugh, hopefully. And uh, as I say, I look forward to hopefully being out and about again soon on one of the bikes. And uh, look forward to seeing you all again in another video. And well, until then, I shall say, tell a lot of it. And thanks for watching.